this this here was the railway station, obviously, and that was the way you went in the entrance to, to uh, they had the little uh, hole there for the uh, to buy your ticket, and the train actually come right into here. That's where the uh, the buffers were, and then down here, halfway on the road here, would be uh, the blackboards. That was the wall of the harbour, and these blackboards run halfway down. The water would come over them at half tide. So the great thing was to see how, how long you could last going on them without getting a wet foot. So yeah, it was all do and there. And then at the wall from the, uh, uh, from the blackboard up to the top, once you could climb up that, you were somebody. Uh, it was like going from short pants into long pants, being able to climb the wall from the blackboard up over the top. Uh, so you go halfway along and stand till the water come up, come up over. Uh, uh, and um, it was actually a fella drowned uh, off there. Yeah, he slipped in because they were all tarred. They were very slippy when they got wet, as you can imagine, with them being tarred. And there was a chap there fell in, he couldn't swim, and he actually drowned. And, uh, yeah, because yeah. there was a slipway here. And then it was further along, another slipway up the end there. And the boat used to all tie in and out here. Yeah. And then the, uh, you had all the, uh, the sidings down here where they used to put the, the uh, carriages. Yeah. And then over the far side was the goods shed. They had a big uh, cargo shed over there with an overhead crane. And they used to come on the, the big trucks with the cargo from, from Douglas. And then they would offload in there. Then shut and then, and then they, uh, the the pebble was the peel train. Yeah, Jack something. He was the he was he was the engine driver, and he was good. He, he used to when we were going to school, like he he could always give that little bit extra, and uh, we'd beat the train out of Douglas, the one going south, and we'd be cheering there uh, all the time. He could give that bit extra. Yeah. Jack Lowney, that was his name, Jack Lowney. Uh, he lived up uh, Patrick Street, uh, number six, the Pebble. Uh, one, the Sutherland, two, the Burby, three, the Pen, the four, the Lock, five, the Mourner, six, the Pebble, seven, the Timble, eight, the Fennell, the nine, the Douglas, ten, the GH1, eleven, the Maitland, twelve, the Hutchinson, thirteen, the Kissick, fourteen, the Thornhill, fifteen, the Manon, sixteen, the Caledonia. <laughs> Used to rattle them all off. Uh, 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 spent many a, many a time on them. Five years going to school, Douglas, walking from the station up to St. Ninians, wet through in the wartime, blackout, and then coming back down at night, 20 past seven train from here, and then uh, getting home then about 20 to six at night, uh, deadbeat, yeah, wet through, uh, learnt nothing. <laughs> uh, coming home then, and then uh, out gallivanting then out at night again, gallivanting. 